one step at a time. That's how the biggest dreams are achieved. So if your dream is to study in the UK, make John Leggett College your next step. Here we're proud of our outstanding reputation for exceptional educational performance with a wide range of academic and vocational courses and excellent links to the UK's top universities to get you where you want to be. Find out more at leggett.ac.uk. JLC, your place to be. Your Morning Show. Podcast. Roses are red. Violets are blue. When we call your man, he'd better choose you. Now let me pick her up. Christine, good morning. Hi, how's it going? Going well, thank you. Guys, your email here for uh, War of the Roses. Let's kind of walk through this. You and Tom are engaged to be married. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We've been together for how long? Um, three years. Okay. And uh, do we meet in person? Do we meet on an app? What's been like the, uh, the love journey, if you will? A friend of a friend. So, okay. Look at that. Cool. So out in the wild. Look at that. Okay. So yeah. we're getting married, but why do we want to do War of the Roses? Because that seems like two counteracting points. Well, I um, I want to make sure that um, the bachelor party doesn't have any nudity um, because my, my husband has had some issues in the past with adult entertainment. <laughs> you know what I mean? And uh, mm. okay. I just want to be sure that there won't be any nudity. Okay, and so we told them specifically, like, hey, I'm not okay with you guys going to the adult club and that kind of thing? Yeah, like, I mean, if it's, like, a dancer and she's in her, you know, lingerie, that's fine. But, like, I don't want any strip clubs or anything like that. And I guess kind of the jump off to this is uh, a girlfriend of one of your husband's friends reached out and kind of tipped you off to what they're planning? Yeah. What'd she say? She said that um, they're they're planning on going to those places, and I I don't want them to go to those places. Okay, and the guest and, <laughs> and like, it's like yeah, why don't you get this? Okay, he has a problem. So are we a worried that if he does go to an adult club and there is nudity, that there would be like cheating, or is it more so the fact that he just didn't follow your uh, wish? Well, with my husband, my yeah, well, to be husband, yeah, I was gonna say, oh, that's like, a whole different story. What? I was going to say it's a whole different story if he already is your husband. I just know, I know my husband and, you know, one dis- bad decision leads to another. Sure. And he's weak that way and I don't want to okay. have that happen for him. S- okay. stupid, stupid question then. Like maybe not the one for us if that's the... No, definitely not. Okay. I mean, okay. Uh, it, this is just one little issue. Gotcha. Okay, so let me do this. Um, I have an idea instead of sending flowers. I'm going to bring back an old uh, tried and true tactic next, Okay. Okay, okay. And it's War of the Roses on your morning show. War of the Roses on your morning show. Let me just recap this, Christine, uh, briefly. You and Tom been together for three years. Uh, how long have you been engaged for? Um, six months. Okay. So the wedding and bachelor party are both in 2023, correct? Yeah. We had given him kind of strict rules. Hey, no uh, dancers, none of that stuff, um, because in the past he's made some poor decisions. But we gotten word from a friend of one of his uh, buddy's girlfriends that it sounds like they're planning on having kind of like a night of debauchery. Is that is that safe to say? Yeah. <laughs> so let me ask Unfortunately. you. Right, but let me ask you this, though, because, again, like, you could, in theory, I don't necessarily know if it's cheating if you go to a strip club or have a bachelor party. As long as he hasn't, is it just the fact that he's seen somebody else naked, or is it, because what to you constitutes cheating, just so we know in the case of War of the Roses? Uh, yeah, topless, um, you know, uh, no pants, <laughs> any of the just, vital parts. Just seeing a naked body. Yeah. Okay, so we're not, we don't think he's cheating as in like hooking up with somebody. We just think he might see somebody naked. Uh, yeah, and okay. uh, like you know, yeah, he has all those TikToks with all the, you know, sketchy women. <laughs> okay, well, like his, his for you page and that kind of thing. Yeah, okay. like I don't. He, he, yeah, gotcha. trying to keep him away. That's okay. Oh, so, no. so let me do this. So okay. instead of calling from the flower shop, we did this months ago, where I called from like an adult entertainment uh, business. Let me do that, and I'll just call from like a dancer uh, academy. Is probably not the right word, but like a. Uh, a rent, a, a, yeah, I get that, that type of thing. And I'll try to entice him uh, to having the bachelor party, okay? Okay, sounds good. Okay, hold on one second. Hold on, let me do this. Uh, of course, I'm going to need my 
uh, very seductive uh, prize talent to be up there if you're ready for the case. Yeah. Yeah, I'm ready. Oh, I thought for sure it was going to be there. Yeah. Oh, I thought for sure. All right, hold on one Hello. second. Here we go. Hold on one second. Your call has been forwarded to an oh, automatic that's not voice good. message. Hold on, hold on. Uh, maybe, maybe he's expecting us. Hold on, let me try this again. This is, uh, we're calling this cell phone. Is that correct, Christine? Yes. Yep, yeah, yeah, perfect. Hold on one second. Yes. Try it again. Hi, calling for Tom, please. Uh, this is who am I speaking with? Steve or Tom? My name is Steve Velvet with uh, Hide Your Wife Entertainment. How are you? I'm doing well. I'll be uh, I'll be qu- I'll be quick to this, man. We are Mop Shop uh, Entertainment here, uh, entertainment company here, uh, primarily focusing in uh, bar mitzvahs and bachelor parties. And you popped up my list right here. Somebody who's currently in the process of uh, possibly wanting to do a bachelor party. Found your uh, site. Found the not page. I wanted to reach out to see if I could interest you in our services. Uh, maybe. I don't Perfect. know. Okay. What, what, what do you guys do? So we, everything from catering, the entertainment to, uh, transportation, all that stuff. Again, uh, we buy lists from the knot and wedding wire. And, uh, do you know, uh, which site you guys are on? Dude, I have no clue. That's not my job. Okay. That's, you leave that to the fiance. Yeah. Okay. Well, she signed up for some sites, and so we get the list from them, and we try to reach out to the bachelors to try to provide that entertainment. Are you looking to have a bachelor party? Uh, yeah. With with adult entertainment, like uh. Uh, yeah, definitely. Okay, perfect. On a scale of one to two, uh, how uh naked do you want the entertainers? I need you to push a button on the phone, please. One or two. Did you push a button? That was a six. That was yeah, a, that was a six. Oh, a six. So you want it to be yeah. beyond nude? Yeah. Okay, yeah. got gotcha. you. Okay. Yeah, absolutely. How, on a scale of uh, attractiveness, zero to ten, how attractive do you want the people to be? Now, I'll let you know that supply and demand goes with the price. Uh, I mean, at least eight. Okay, got gotcha. you. Eight for sure. Nice uh Almost prime number. Uh, do you believe in discretion? Do you mind if we post photos online, or are you trying to hide this from somebody special in your life? No, I think it's best that we go for discretion. Okay. Are you looking to do this as an overnight thing, or can we come to you? Uh, you know what? Why don't we do an overnight thing? Overnight thing. Okay. So that so our our folks would stay with you. Uh, I mean, yeah, potentially. Okay. And there's no issue there about um. You know, somebody walking in who shouldn't be there? No, 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 no. I, I, we'll, we'll clear it out. I'll make sure she goes to her sisters that week. Okay, perfect. Yeah, we wouldn't want that. Uh, now, so we have some AI software here I'm pretty excited about, and I put all your answers in here. I'm gonna, we have a, um, a database of all the entertainers, and I'm going to have them say hello to you. You're going to pick your entertainer from there, okay, on a scale of one to two as far as you're happy or not, okay? All right, cool. This first per- entertainer is Helena. Helena, say hello. Hey, how you doing, big boy? Oh God, no one zero. As, okay, that she's a uh, okay a zero. Okay, uh, this next one, this next girl, Viviana, say hello. Hi, how you doing? Uh, that, let's go with a better uh, one and a half. One and a half. So basically, two. Uh, this next one, let me give you Sabrina. Hey. Uh, not great. Uh, not great. Let's go visit here. Yeah. Wait, are you sure not great? Try again, Sabrina. Hey, big boy. How you doing? <laughs> yeah, no. No, that's, that's, that's a lot of bass. How about your fiance? That is a fair question, though. Um, Damn. Tom? Oh. If she can't say, well, let me just clarify. Tom, my name is John, as is uh, Eric, played the part of Olga, Helga. Tom, that is your fiance, Christine. Uh, she wanted to test to see the bachelor party, and it sounds mm-hmm. like it's probably worse than her wildest imagination. Yeah. Uh, These words, you bad person. So, Christine, let yeah. me ask you, though. Here we are. What do you want to do with this? <sighs> I want him to... I mean, what? It's, 
I can't do this anymore. What do what? Nothing happened. What what are you talking well, about? No time, what, I mean, you were gonna have them sleep over? Oh my gosh. This is gross. Baby, it's not for me, okay? You know Oh uh, yeah it is. Baby, yes, baby, is. baby. Whole... Yeah, okay, I think we got enough of what we need here. Uh you guys, Tom, you have yeah. a blessed time with I'm gonna send Olga and Cinnamon over to your house, okay? Yeah, we're coming. Please God no. If I miss it on the show, I download the podcast. Your morning show with John Riley and Rose. One step at a time. That's how the biggest dreams are achieved. So if your dream is to study in the UK, make John Leggett College your next step. Here we're proud of our outstanding reputation for exceptional educational performance with a wide range of academic and vocational courses and excellent links to the UK's top universities to get you where you want to be. Find out more at leggett.ac.uk. JLC, your place to be.